See that fire? Look at it, it flared up big time. As raging forest fires threaten the northern Saskatchewan community of Sandy Bay, Shit fire there too. Elder Evelyn McDonald was evacuated Tuesday from her home in the Northern Reserve. I went for a walk and I took pictures. I saw seen a lot of smoke. Oh, it's that anxiety. You know, I panic. The community is included under the umbrella of Peter Ballantyne Cree Nation. Evacuees say the flames were getting closer just before they left, and the smoke made it difficult for them to breathe. They're staying in hotels in Prince Albert and other cities. The elderly and vulnerable were taken out first. Dozens of other people are expected to join them this week. I'm worried about my grandchildren and my, some of my kids are still back home, so, but they'll be in today, I hope. The elders tell me they have everything they need here in Prince Albert, but they'd much rather be at home. The chief of the Peter Ballantyne Cree Nation says it didn't have to be this way. He says that the provincial government refused to mobilize First Nations firefighters when the flames were lower several weeks ago, and as a result, the fire has gotten out of control. And yet we have hundreds of firefighters. Lac La Ronde has firefighters. Peter Ballantyne has firefighters. Montreal Lake, all the woodland Cree. Uh, we have uh, the Northern Dene, they have very well-trained firefighters as well, experienced firefighters that could be utilized. I just can't figure it out, like, why would you let a fire go that close to a community until it becomes a huge problem and then try and manage it? It's, at that point, it's unmanageable. Right now, the wildfire covers an area of roughly 130 square kilometers. That's roughly double the size of the city of Prince Albert. No one from the provincial government was made available for an interview, but in a statement, they say that they're monitoring the situation and will take any necessary measures. Jason Warwick, CBC News, Prince Albert.